All right, well, today's the day. Today's the day I'm gonna go to the chiropractor appointment. Just kind of showing you my day a little bit, really. I haven't vlogged in a very long time, so yeah, that's kind of the plan. I'm just gonna go to my chiropractor, show you guys exactly what kind of goes on during the day. I'm gonna try to do some other stuff. Let me just set this here. Holy, f I don't, this camera's like a thousand freaking pounds. Right, you're so, right, you're right there, right? That's how we wake up, that's how we do it. Nice, slight elbow, right? Because you're here. Right, and he comes in, right? He's here, and then you're right there. And then you're done. That ain't a joke. It's not a joke around here, okay? How are you doing? How you doing? We're going down to Jesse. He's gonna get his, right? Crack in the right positions. So maybe show a little bit of that, not too much. I don't know, I'm just gonna kind of vlog a little bit today. And hopefully, it, hopefully it goes well. I gotta go. Man, I don't even know what to do here. Hopefully that microphone's working. <laughs> Cause I have not checked yet. Oh! All right, hear me out now. I'm literally holding you guys in, in my hand. Yes! Let's go see what, let's go see what Madison's doing. There you go, what's up? This is, dude, what the frick is this? I was asking yeah. if he wanted, there's this guy down in Austin, which is like, four hours away from where we live. I was asking if he's willing to trade for another camera, so I was asking Matt if he would want to trade, and Matt said no, because this camera's worth more. Correct, it is. And we're going through this guy because he's given a deal. So we're out there searching for deals. We're searching and we're, we're getting the job dialed in that way. So that's what I'm gonna go do. That's the plan. Look, I have a hunchback. <laughs> All right, so we're on the way to the chiropractor. We're gonna go get adjusted. I'm actually finally excited to be able to share with you guys kind of like the whole process of how that all works. Now let's get to the real business of why we're in the car, okay? Hopefully you guys have maybe been hearing about my music career kind of taking off, you know, really. it. Uh, when I was sitting in the in the car, the West Texas shootout with Colin just singing, the calf in my booty crack. It's gonna become a meme that I do it with a song and I'm actually gonna create a song called Decaf. The vibe of the, like the beat that I was just thinking was, Right, so like I was just creating that and then in my head I decided to create that song a specific song about decaf because I needed some filler words My boys over at SMLE if you guys know who they are absolute crusher dudes, right? They're just mega over there. They're, they're awesome uh, and they actually created something kind of clean So I'm gonna sing a little bit and I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about here. We go I got, I got that decaf in my booty crack. I got that so cream and a sugar in that I got that, I got that decaf and I'm not gonna quit I got that McDonald's and I'm loving it I got that we the best when we hop on the track And I got decaf shoved up my booty crack I got that decaf in my booty crack I got that But that's kind of the spiel of that, right? Right! It's exciting stuff. So then there's that kind of that. And then there's also another one that I've been, I've been kind of, I've been wanting to do. <laughs> we'll see what you guys think about this one. Yeah. Look. Yeah. <laughs> Matt Sharp on the track. I need a decaf, decaf. I'm gonna need that, need that. Decaf, decaf. I'm gonna need that, need that. I said decaf, decaf. I'm gonna need that, need that. It's me, myself, and I. I'm my own competitor. I want the decaf and none of the regular. Man, it's hot. It's too hot. Check the temperature, man. I'm super hot. Chemical. I'm going molecular. Like, look at me. I'm back, though. It's off the dome. I just bought that new Tesla and it's all chrome. Psych, no it's not, you know it's all black, that's a fact It's crazy when Matt Sharp hops on the track I be killing it, ripping it, I be flipping it, dipping it I be making all them pancakes and flipping and ripping them Like yo, hold up, let me get some eggs and bacon No, don't talk to me, cause girl, trust me, I'm taken Taken by my wife, and she the best, trust me Don't you ever come in me, cause I'ma shoot my three Oh my gosh! You hear me? So anyway, that's just a little bit of a freestyle for you Cause see, that's just kinda how we roll around here All right, so the first machine we're getting on is called the decompression machine. It's a beautiful machine, I use it a lot. That's the guy right there. That's the dude. So I'll sit down, I'll lay down right here, and it'll essentially take my lower back and move it this way while keeping my upper body up here. And it just kind of helps take a lot of pressure off my lower back. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Obviously, hopefully you guys could see it, like my lower lower part of my uh, body kind of separate from my upper part of my body. It's you, You're on there only for like 10, 10 to 15 minutes max. Um, I've used a couple of de different decompression machines and it's one of those things that I really didn't know that I needed until I started using them. So it feels really, really solid. Obviously you also saw me at the end there kind of stretch. You gotta be very careful and you gotta make sure you stretch afterwards. All right, and this, this is kind of where I get adjusted. There's a couple of different tables here. Jesse's also a very avid golfer. So he, he has a little simulator he's got built in here too. And uh, there's a good, good flag right up there. 
So he's a big fan of Giga too, which is absolutely beautiful. And if you guys are ever in, in, in the area and you need an adjustment, I would come to Talos Chiropractic 100%. This guy's great. He knows what he's doing. And there's the man. Let's go. That's the man of the hour. Yeah, I don't know. I've just kind of been talking about what I do. Told him you're a big fan of us, which is huge. <laughs> big fan. That's the only reason I'm here, actually, because he's a big fan. Absolutely. That's the only reason we do this. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But uh, yeah, I usually do. I'll do a decompression session usually, and then Jesse will kind of like go through some of the stuff. We're here now, so I'm going to set the camera up, and then we'll just you'll just kind of go through it. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Most important thing is consistency. That's right. Dude, that's nasty. You put a little extra weight on the decompression table. Mm -hmm. Nice. I feel good. Ah. Hey there. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. God, that is just this. Yeah, I can tell last time. Oh, you, why? It, it hurts so bad. I feel like more on the left. Open the knees up. There you go. And then we're going to put the knees down. Good. Now raise the ankles apart, but keep the knees together. Which one's harder for you to do? That should be this one. Yep. Yeah, this, this hip has yeah. just been... It's, feel it. I have okay, so ready? Here, do this one. So mm -hmm. lower this leg down. Yeah. And then I want you to just lift it up straight. Good, good, good. Oh. And lower down. And we obviously don't have too much time, but I do want to say that Jesse is just such a great dude. A lot of the good, good guys go to see Jesse, and he's just very personable. He likes to talk to you so that that way he can actually fix your problem. All right, well, that is going to wrap up uh, my session. Check out Talos. They are genuinely just some really phenomenal people, really nice, wholesome people. I don't know if you guys remember this, but I think my the last time I got my injection shot was last June. So in a couple, in you know, three or so months, it'll be a full year since my injection. So, and I haven't had another blowout yet. Um, obviously, praise God for that. I, I've really been asking the Lord to heal me and, and I feel like he has been, he's been looking out for me. So, and thanks for all your guys' prayers too. I know, I know a lot of you guys have been, you know, praying for me and asking for my back to be healed and stuff. So I truly can't thank you guys enough for that. But Jesse has also been a very big help as well. For me, it's been working. I've been going to the chiropractor twice a week. I also just talked to Jesse. He's gonna hook me up with some PT care. So I'm gonna get back into that. I, and if I wanna play golf at a high level, which I do, so I want to keep that going moving forward into some of the Google weeks. Hopefully you guys enjoy that. Jesse, once again, thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. What's for dinner? Should get you doing the roses. Should I? Should you? <laughs> like I said, we're back home after the chiropractic appointment. I have got, ah, I got to finish these roses. I've been planting, been planting myself some roses. Come check them out. You spend so much money on roses during the summer for me. So, so, he, so, so he's like, why not just plant them? Why not just plant them? See, that's called being smart, guys. There's one of them. Don't mind my decrepit backyard, but it works. There's that. And then I gotta move some rocks and some roots and stuff, and then there's gonna be the other hole right there. So, tacos, baby, look at them things. Ooh, greasy chicken. Well, there we are. This is my shrine, obviously. <laughs> Yeah, I know you guys are looking at love looking at it. So obviously you can see you can see the Millennium Falcon right there You can see Hogwarts see my three heads Boba Fett Stormtrooper Darth Vader a wing R2D2 you guys know the business But if you don't see it, maybe you do right there the new edition the Republic gunship 2013 right there uh, The box where they still had Yoda on it. That's the one honestly. It's a really fun piece oh, Let's just take a look at it. Look at this thing. I mean, it's an absolute glorious piece. You obviously these I Say obviously like you know, I mean geez these things come out. It's the only thing that I wish that would happen is like, I wish the wings could actually move. And then obviously like a nice little holder. So like when you're, right, when you're actually playing with it, which I don't do, right? I'm a grown man. Um, anyway, if you guys are following my Snapchat, uh, msharf24 right here, pink, then maybe you can get some more behind the scenes footage. I'm filming a lot on Snapchat pretty much every day. It's just a little easier, obviously, filming whole YouTube videos and have me having to edit these vlogs and stuff. It's just, it can get a little hectic. So I've really been trying to take care of my health outside of, you know, my Google Weeks and all my travel and stuff. Just really trying to dial that in and I've been doing it for a while, so. But I, I do want to film some more stuff for you guys. I mean, it's not gonna get, you know, a ton of views, I guess, but who cares about that, right? <laughs> cares about that. Life here has been pretty solid. Nothing really too, I guess, as far as an update really goes. I want to do uh, a warehouse one as well, so you guys can see, I'll but go shoot some baskets, I'll hit some golf balls, you guys can see, I guess you've already, already, you've already seen everything, but we'll just kind of go do a fun little simulator day, and I will show you my new iron shafts that I got, my new clubs. So stay tuned for my new clubs. Um, there is a little bit of a tweak that I made. Maybe you guys know it, maybe you don't, and also the new Fujikura shafts as well. So I'll kind of dive more into that for my next video. Yeah, I love you guys. I really do. You guys are awesome. And uh, I guess we'll catch you guys kind of the next one. Find someone you love, give them a hug, call them. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, have a great day. Love you guys.